Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super excited. We're taking a look at a rear living travel trailer with three separate seating areas. This is the all new 2021 Grand Design Imagine Model 3100 RG. We are gonna take a look at the outside features first, then the inside features then. We're gonna give you three things we love about the Grand Design Imagine and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Hey everyone, again, welcome back to another video. My name is Matt from Matt's RV Reviews, Towables. It's the world's only channel giving you that chill and bias review about everything when it comes to RVs. And again, today I'm super excited to be going over this brand new Grand Design Imagine because you know what that means. Yes, today is September 1st and we have brought back the Matt's RV Reviews Towable channel. But before we begin, I would like to say hi to Andrea. Hey, Andrea. Hi, everybody. How's it going? It's going good. I'm really excited. I haven't done a travel trailer in a really long time. Yep. So let's just hope I'm up to par. Yep, and watch tell everybody where we are. We are in Wixom, Michigan. Wixom, Michigan, y'all. We are right here, y'all. We are right here in the, in the mitt. Um, just to bring some awesome reviews for you guys. Let's begin. Model is the Imagine 3100 RD, but the actual tip to tip length of this travel trailer is 35 feet, 11 inches. The dry weight on this baby is 7,778 pounds and the hitch weight is 7,090. No, 791 pounds. 791 pounds vertical hitch weight. Up front here, look, we do have a nice power tongue jack. I love that. Right here, you do have the propane tanks. It is good for two 20 pound propane tanks. And then right up here, we do have this nice black diamond plate. Good for rock, rock guards, everything. And then check this out. I love this. Feel this black right here, Andrea. Feel it, feel it. Look, it's like a nice dark coat material. Oh, yeah. I like that. But then you have the smooth white fiberglass with the LED lights right there. Looks fancy. Uh huh. Coming down the side. Look at this, nice pasture storage held up by a magnet. Tons of pasture absolutely. storage. I absolutely love that. And then check that out. Boom. Nice. Right there, uh, stabilizing jacks. They are manual jacks. I'm totally fine with that. You get to where you're going, you just take a quarter of the chill. Zoom, 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 zoom. You are good to go. Look at this. Look at this. The slide out's all the way down at the end. So you have this huge power awning with LED lights. I love that. You have these nice, more ride solid steps super awesome and then let's check out what's going on here check out these tires andrea these are the super st tires st 225-75 r15 right here you do have hookup for power and a coax if you do want to have an outside grill grand design does not use the frameless windows but they do have the three-year structural warranty i believe they do the three-year one year and then let's finish up over here coming around the back look at this we got a great place for a stinky slinky love that here's a spray port Psst. if you want a little outdoor shower or whatever right here you do have a spare tire look it's the super st tire i love how they give you a place to mount it on the back as well and this is a 50 amp travel trailer and so you do have your 50 amp hookup right there also you have a one piece pvc roof also you have a place for a backup camera andrea let's go up on the roof and check it out all right matt here we go now hold on okay up here on the roof you can see this nice one piece pvc roof so this is a 50 amp travel trailer but there is only one air conditioning unit it is prepped for the second one right up there you have your nice slide out over here double slide outs and then right here you do have a wine guard digital antenna you ready yes here we go now. Hold on. Last step, Matt. Ugh. Great. And if you haven't already, make sure you smash that thumbs up button. What do the RV salesman go take his fat ass up on the roof? Show you what features the roof has to offer. Nobody. And Andrea, we'd like to throw a plug in there for our new keychains. Bing. We have five different designs of the keychains, and we are only selling them between today and the end of the month. So make sure you get them. Thanks, y'all. Finishing up. Right here is your black tank dump. Right there, easy to access. You have your water heater right there. 
here's your black tank flush and then andrea here's your portable water fill potable potable and then check this out oh. outdoor shower here fresh water fill here's where you fill plug in your cable and everything very nice easy to access and everything well andrea the outside of this travel trailer looks great but the inside looks even better let's go take a look let's see if he skips in michigan i skip in michigan <laughs> Oh, and I forgot to mention, this does have the Arctic insulation four season package. We're gonna go with the door open. Do you know why? Yes, because it's Look hot. Look at that thermostat. It says 94 degrees in here. Look at that. Woo, it's hot. Yes. Okay, look at this. Very nice. You know, the setup here reminds me of being in a fifth wheel. Yep. Now everybody, while Andre is showing you the whole travel trailer, if you could, please leave down in the comments below, let us know three things you like about this travel trailer and three things you don't like about it. We are just now ramping up our towable channel again, so we need your feedback to help uh, trigger the YouTube algorithm to make it worth our while to do these awesome videos again. And we thank you. Yes, we do. Andrea. Yes, look at this. This is where I wanna get started. Look at this. Doesn't this feel like a fifth wheel? It does. Feels like a fifth wheel. You got your TV right here. Fireplace. Look at that. It's so huge and nice. Look at the doors. It's yeah. so modern with the handles and contemporary. I love that. And look, you even have it above. And they're like Euro style a little yeah, bit. Yeah, very much so. I like the lights behind. Very nice. I like the windows in here. Yes. Very nice windows, and I love the slow rise privacy shades. You know, even the slides look good. Look at that. Yeah, even when, even when those shades were down, it still felt bright in here, and now it feels even brighter. You have not one, but two sofas. They are both sleeper sofas, but I'm not sitting in those. You know why? Because I'm sitting in the Thomas Paine collection. You know that's right. I'm sitting right here, center cup holder, one for beer. And then another one for beer, yeah. for backup beer. <laughs> you got your massage seats, light seats, everything. It feels awesome. Directly across Directly from the TV. Directly across as I'm watching the game. Over here, um, let me go over here. Over here, I love what they did with the dinette. You have the freestanding table and chairs. And the way they structure this travel trailer is so great because you know, very rarely, I've never seen three sofas in a travel trailer. Either have I. The dinette area is going to be a little tight in this walkway, is, but it's worth it to have a seating area like that. I agree. Well, Andrea, it's now time for the MSRP. MSRP on this travel trailer here is $43,674 MSRP. Sale price is, Andre, do you know what the sale price is? I have no idea. Nobody does. Do you know why? Because we cannot advertise sale price because it's a current model year grand design. But here's what I promise you. If you go down in the description below to generalrv.com or if you go to on General's RV website and click get lowest price on this model and you make sure you say you saw it on Matt's RV reviews, I promise you we will get you the best sale price in America. Andrea, tell everybody what to do. You can call, you can text, you can email, you can FaceTime. Hey, 301-906-0962. That's my personal self. If you have questions, or if you're interested on price, just go to generalrv.com and go to the Grand Design tab, and we will be able to get you the best, most phenomenalist deal ever. The, Andrea. The best, most phenomenalist? Phenomenalist. Okay. You heard it here first. Let's continue the video. Start okay. back there. Oh, yeah, true. I forgot about this. Okay, so this is fantastic. Look at this pantry. Wow. This gives you fifth wheel storage, doesn't it, right this, here? It's a travel trailer with a fifth wheel. Exactly. It's like a travel trailer on the outside, <laughs> but a fifth wheel on the inside. I really do like these cabinets. I mean, this is new. I mean, new in my, I've never seen it. Either have I. So, you know, anytime I see something new, I get super excited. Super duper. Got a window, window right there. there. And look at these drawers, you guys. Drawers are nice. Great room. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we got countertop here. We got a little microwave. Yep. And you get a three burner cooktop. Furion. Furion cooktop. With oven. Nice. And look at the refrigerator. Okay. Andre, no, there's a drawer underneath the oh, oven. Sorry, guys. It's this heat in here. Yeah, it's hot in here. What is that? I don't know. Our viewers will know. 
Uh, if you guys know what that is, let yeah, us know what let that us is. Yeah, let us know what that is. That's weird. Okay, so here we go with the refrigerator. This is your two-way Dometic fridge that runs off your shore power and propane. Yep, propane Very and Very nice. And check this out. So if you didn't have enough counter space, you got more over here. Yep. Look at that. Awesome. Nice cabinetry. Yes, ma'am. More cabinetry. More. More. Because more is always better than less. More is better than less, yep. Nice big square sink. Yep. Very nice. And you got the extension. We got drawers under here. Mm-hmm. And more mm. cabinetry. Very nice. But what if you run out of counter space? Uh, if you run out of counter space, you have this extension. Look at that. Even more sto awesome. uh, counter space. And then you did miss this. Did I? I got you, okay. though. I got your back. I blame it on the 94 degrees in here. But the heat index. Look, everybody. It's the first time I got an extension down. Man, that's nice. Let's <laughs> check out this bathroom. Ooh. Wow. I love it. Nice size shower. Wow. 30 by 36 shower. I love it. You yep, have Nautilus. the store right here. Very nice. You have a little bit of storage up here. Max air fan. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Fantastic fan, whatever. Got the light. Show everybody that sink right there. Okay, look at this. Very nice, like the counter space here. You got your medicine cabinet. For all your medicines. And Matt, let me see that. Well, wait, what about the sink? Under the sink, we have a little bit of storage. And we got three drawers. One, two, three. Okay. So there also is a little cubby right here. Nice. You have three for your linens. And I'll dry you. Yes. It's now time for the toilet test. Okay, I gotta see this. Porcelain. Nice space, good shoulders. Andrea, <laughs> this is a prom pooping position. Bing! I love it. It's just a... The, this is your happy place. It's babe? just a grand design. In nice. Here. And you have a pocket door here on the bathroom. Yep. A pocket door on the bedroom. Uh huh. And here we go into the bedroom. Into the bedroom we go. Wow! Look at that. Look at all the storage you can stow. Look at this. Nice. They yes. still have the same Euro look. Yep. On this side as well, you have the what's it called? The wardrobe. More drawers. There, and Andrea. Yes. Behind you, you we have, have a wardrobe. more. More drobe on the wardrobe. Yeah. Oh, the Ooh. light turns on. Okay, and two drawers. Yes. And I guess you could probably. I wonder where you could do your TV. Oh, so, over here. Yep, you mount it right there. Nice. And Andrea, let me see if there is storage underneath. Actually, I do want to show this to the viewers. Show over em. here by the bed, you have a little cubby here, USB electrical outlet on both sides and the reading lights here. Perfect. Oh, yeah, we do have storage under there. Oh, they gave yep. you like a little separate space. Yep, I like it. Awesome. Well, Andrea, it's hot. Yes, it's hot. And as hot as it is, and as awesome as it is, it's now time we give everybody three things we love about this travel trailer and three things we dislike about it. Andrea, what should we do first? Let's do three things we dislike about it. Okay, I'm gonna go first. Only because I'm hot. Okay. And we don't have the AC on. But I do not like how a uh, travel trailer this size and this expensive is only giving you one AC unit. I and agree. making the option for two. Because it should, I, be standard. it should just be standard two AC units with a with a travel trailer this big. Right. That's one. Two, Andrea. Wow. I don't know at this point. I'm sorry, I can't think of it. I can slide. give you a number two. What? You ready? Yes. Because of how this is laid out, it is very small walkways. You know what I'm saying? Yes. Like two people can't cross or whatever, but it's okay because I'd rather have the walkway small and the living space bigger, but it can get pretty tight and confined in here at some times in some places, okay? So that's two, and then three, do you have a third? You know, I don't think so. Mm. I'm sorry. I, I just no, no, no. It's, it's very, really, it's very, it's very well. hard for me to pick at this. It's very nice. It's very well designed. Here's what I might say. Let, let me let me go back in the bedroom. Um, even that table I think is pretty good. Yeah. I mean, I just bathroom. Feel like there was something. Bathroom is done very well. Okay, let's go outside. Oh yeah, there's something outside. So, 
Oh, I don't even know. Okay, well we're gonna roll with the three likes then. No, 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 no. I'm gonna make it this. Uh, this bumper is it's in, so I couldn't use it as a step for climbing up, and um, and yeah, it's funny. That's just gonna be my third dislike, and there's nothing anybody can do about it because I have to find three, and we're doing this live, so that's three. Andrea, what's up? We're doing three likes. Yes. Now we're gonna do three things we love about this travel trailer. Andrea, okay, do you want to go gonna, first? Yeah, I'm gonna go first. Okie okay, dokie. I'm really super excited, you guys. Hey, 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 hey. I got it. No frameless windows. True. On a travel trailer that's this expensive, yes. everybody else is putting frameless windows True. in. Bam, bam, bam. I'm okay. glad I found one. So here's my lights, you guys. I am really excited about the cabinetry here being this Euro style look. I yes. haven't seen it yet. Not, so this mm -hmm. makes me really, really happy to see this change. It looks great. Not only that, um, so Winnebago does the Euro, right? Normally only in their motorhomes. In their motorhomes, yes. right? But they didn't replicate it with the high shine. Yes. It's a, it's it a matted, it's matted a matted, yes. it's a I matted um, Euro look. So I do love that. Uh, another. So that's one. My second light. Number two. This living area is, is fantastic. Crazy. You, I've never seen this on a travel trailer. I don't even know how this is legal. I know. It feels like you're in a fifth wheel. It feels like you're breaking the law. Yes. <laughs> you're breaking the law on this travel trailer. I absolutely love it. To have it, the way they designed it is super awesome and nice. And I'm a big fan of this rear living. So three. The shower. Oh, the shower. Nope. Nope, the whole dang thing. Wow. The shower, the toilet, the storage, the sink, the pocket door right here. Everything about this bathroom they made perfect. They did. And it's funny because they didn't sacrifice size on the bathroom. Again, they took some shortcuts with it being so narrow and everything to try to make the three sofas work, but they didn't do it with the bathroom. And you shouldn't take shortcuts in the bathroom because that's where you go to the bathroom. It's in the bathroom. Let's step outside. Okay. Well, Andrea, that's it. That's the review. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. Leave down in the comments below. Are you guys happy that we're bringing back Matt's RV? Yes. And Let us you know. know. We, we are bringing back more reviews for you guys, the RV Review Crew. And if you haven't already gotten your official Matt's RV Review keychain, bing, make sure you get it because we're only selling them between now and the end of the month. Because what how it all works, it's on Teespring, and it's a batch order. They sell them all at one time make them all and ship them all all at one time at the end of the month if you guys have any questions about this grand design please go on general rv's website it's generalrv.com i'll have a link down in the description below or just go onto their website generalrv.com or if you have any questions about it feel free to call me call me text me send me an email it is matt's rv reviews at gmail.com or 301-906-0962 that's my cell phone andrea do you have anything you want to say yes Everybody, thanks so much for watching. I hope you guys are happy that we are back into travel trailers and towables. Let us know the three things that you like about this momentum and the three things that you just imagine. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> imagine. Let us know the three things that you like about this and the three things that you dislike. Grand Design will be reading the comments, so we appreciate everybody's feedback. I hope you guys are staying safe and you guys are well. Awesome. Thanks at, for watching. At least you stayed in the right family of manufacturers. I did, I did. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching, Andrea. We'll, we'll see, see you next time. time.